guys and welcome to a new video so I'm at the Azon store I'm waiting actually outside on the stairs again and it's actually snowing today but I got my ticket to get Nelly so I'm going to get the second fox in the series and I'm pretty happy about it uh, so I just like woke up and came straight away I'm feeling kind of sick since yesterday so uh, I'm very glad the queue is very small today so it shouldn't take too long for me to go and get her and uh, yeah then I'm going to go back to bed and hibernate I guess like a bear because it's snowing anyway um, I'll see you when I get her later so guys I got uh, Nelly so she's in the box and today is also the start of the Little Fairy Festival so I actually took a picture of all of that so I'm going to put that for you uh, just now but uh, when I go home I'm going to open her for you and like do the, the review on this video too so uh, I hope you enjoy that so yeah uh, lots of dolls today and I think they have like very interesting new um, little dolls I think there is a place where you're supposed to choose between one to eight dolls which are the little fairy with the curly hair so they like remade the little maids and put curly hair on them so I I think the, the thing is to actually vote for one of those and that they are going to release her but I'm not completely sure like I didn't like spend a lot of time checking that but I think there is something like that going on and then they have all those um, Oake dolls and they also have some like Oake clothes on regular dolls so like a lot of very very cute things guys anyway talk to you in a bit Yesterday my friend sent me a message about those kittens, they are like fully articulated, kind of ball jointed 
cat and they're in the ketchup. So I'm going to try and get a few of them. And then I'll show them to you when I get home too. <laughs> again it has actually been quite some time since I went to pick up Nelly so uh, I haven't opened her yet uh, I was kind of sick like I had a big headache and sore throat and all that so uh, I haven't opened her yet so what I'm going to do today is I'm going to open her for you and do a complete review and uh, you're going to see also some pictures that I have taken so I'm going to take a picture of her obviously but I have been to the uh, a zone uh, event uh, a second time and I also took picture of my dolls there so you're going to see like the three little maid kitten uh, on pictures so uh, that's the plan so let's start with those pictures and then I'm going to open her for you and show her to you from close up <laughs> second fox in the series so we have the maid kittens uh, so Lee, Pooh, Vel and Erino and Ryan and uh, Nelly are foxes so first let's start with the background and the book so the background is that shrine again that's uh, what you just saw in the previous pictures so basically they created the diorama of this shrine and it's a really really nice setting to take picture of your dolls I had a lot of fun with that and I also brought like the little cats uh, that I got at the um, catch-up-on and so that's a lot of fun. So uh, let's have a look at the book. So uh, first you have a picture of both of them so in that setting just in front of the shrine. Uh, they have the gate actually at the front here. So. Then you have everything she comes with, so this is a little fairy Nelly and she comes with this yukata, the apron that goes with, the skirt that goes with, uh, this um, hair, hair band with the fox ears and some uh, little bell, the fox tail, shoes the socks and ends and the bloomers obviously then you have a picture of both of them so this is Ryan who came first and this is like Nelly who just came out this February picture of both of them and basically that's it so uh, we also have here explanation on how to put on the 
shoes uh, with those um, little elastic here so I'm going to take that out because I'm obviously going to put on her shoes so it's really easy you just have to loop the the elastic around the shoe like cross it over around her ankle and put it underneath the shoe and the shoe fit really well uh, my uh, Raya never lost her shoe so far so that's pretty good so let's have a look at the doll herself so uh, first everything at the back so it's a, all the pair of hands so that's like the same pair of hands as all the little fairies so far uh, then we have shoes so that's traditional shoes that you're supposed to wear with the yukata and normally of course the toes go uh, here on each side but you can't do that with dolls because their toes are not well they are even wearing socks anyway so uh, you have to jungle that with the elastic here then we also have the ear piece head piece so it's a med thingy that she's wearing plus her fluffy little fox ears so they're kind of at the back but you can push through and then make them straighter a little bit you can see you can hear the bells and it's very fluffy at the front okay so that's all for that so now we can take a look at the doll herself okay lots of tape today so here we go Nelly is out it's freedom day so she is um, I think she's very purple she has the purple skirt here so the skirt you can put it on top of the yukata or underneath everything like it's here and she has like this big little fairy hands obviously she has like light purple here and around the color so we're going to see that and of course her big big fox tail which is wired so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put on her shoes and her hair accessory and I'm going to remove the plastic here and then I'm going to show her to you from close up so guys here is our little Nelly so uh, Nelly always come in pair with Raya so she's like the second one and she has like the same hairstyle this time around so very long hair so let's start the review with the hair so she has this uh, princess hairstyle with the pigtails so separated very neatly in one line at the back of the head and you have the pigtail on each side then she has this hair accessory so it's a med accessory like in her hair so you have this uh, less over the headband and you have this um, red ribbon and of course the little bells on each side near her ears and the um, big fox ears are attached at the top so they are brown because she's a brown fox and she has like fluffy white plush inside her ears then I said she was very purple because she also comes with purple eyes so it's like purple at the top like darker purple at the top a little bit lighter purple in the center and that line of pink at the bottom so she has a very cute expiration I guess like her face is really really cute and she has little blush on her cheek and of course a general little dot that has not always put on this doll then she has so a very fancy outfit she is wearing that uh, like traditional Japanese style outfit with the yukata and the apron so let's start by um, checking out the outfit piece by piece and I'm going to remove the things one by one so that you can see everything so first you have the apron with those two little uh, Chinese knot style of thing 
and you have the red ribbon at the bottom and the less some more less and it's actually crossed at the at the bottom here you have the big bow at the back and so you can remove the bow it's separated so it's a clip button so let me put it back and then you have a second clip button here to undo around our waist and then you also have clip buttons on each side where those are crossed so one on the left side and one on the right side so you uncross them and then you can pull the apron here we go so underneath the apron she has this uh, sort of yukata very flowery red fabric for the yukata it has of course big sleeves so it's kind of open on the side here you have the edge in light lavender purple color same here lavender purple color and of course you have also the glittery little golden thing uh, because she's New Year, so she has to be like kind of glittery style, I guess. And then uh, she's also wearing the obi, so the uh, fox tail is attached to the obi. You know, the obi is attached around her waist with those two little crochet, and she has a sort of golden greenish obi with a decoration here with um, a little bow at the center. And you have a pink color underneath and this is a pink color so under that she is wearing her skirt so a folded skirt uh, very very purple again like a lot darker purple so you can basically use that skirt on the top of the yukata or underneath as you as you like of course bloomers at the bottom like and socks so kind of uh, flesh color transparent little socks and of course the shoes so you can see the um, plastic wrapped around the wrinkle turn over and wrapping around the shoe so the shoes stay in place really really well so and you can actually pull the thread here red thread on top of her toes to make it look even better so here you go so let me put everything back down and I haven't talked about the tail that much so the tail is actually brown this time with the pointy uh, white color here so like kind of um, a normal folks I would say like we have in Europe and then she's wearing that bow that goes with the obi on top of her tail. Uh, I don't think you can remove it. No, the tail is actually attached to the obi, so you can't remove the tail. And the tail is all wired, so you can give it any shape you actually like. So if you want to put it on the side or up or anything, so it's really well wired. So that's a really nice fluffy tail. So guys, that's it for today. Let me know what you think about this doll. Do you like or little Nelly or do you prefer Ryan? Which is your favorite fox? Do you prefer the foxes or the cats? I think the fox are kind of really nice because Azon has been making a hell lot of cat. So I think it's it was nice of them to actually change animal and have a little fox for uh, this time. I'm still bummed, you know, about the pig uh, because she's a Happy New Year doll. Uh, normally Azon make Happy New Year doll that come out during the um, uh, doll show but this year the doll show is in March so I think they decided to have them earlier so she's kind of a happy new year doll too because she comes with uh, Rayam who was actually on New Year's Day at the Adam store so anyway guys let me know what you think about this doll uh, would you have liked to have a little pig instead because uh, this year is the year of the pig so that would have been interesting, I guess. You can always sew her a little pig costume, I suppose. 
anyway so um leave me your comment in the comment section below don't forget to give me a thumb up if you like this video don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet see you next time for something else and have fun whatever you do bye